Nigeria is indeed making significant strides in infrastructure development, spearheading a wave of transformative mega-projects that are reshaping the nation's physical and economic landscape. These ambitious endeavors reflect Nigeria's commitment to fostering sustainable growth, enhancing competitiveness, and improving the quality of life for its citizens. Among the notable mega-projects currently underway in Nigeria, several stand out for their scale, scope, and impact on various sectors of the economy. These projects encompass critical infrastructure investments in transportation, energy, urban development, and social services, aimed at addressing long-standing challenges and unlocking new opportunities for progress. One such project is the construction of modern highways and expressways, aimed at improving connectivity and easing the movement of goods and people across the country. These road networks not only facilitate T-Rate and commerce, but also enhance accessibility to remote areas, promoting social inclusion and economic development. In addition to transportation infrastructure, Nigeria is investing heavily in energy projects, including the construction of power plants and renewable energy initiatives. These projects are essential for addressing the country's energy needs, promoting industrialization, and driving economic growth. Furthermore, Nigeria is undertaking ambitious urban development projects, such as the construction of new cities and the revitalization of existing urban centers. These initiatives are designed to accommodate rapid urbanization, alleviate congestion, and provide essential services and amenities to urban residents. Social infrastructure projects, including the construction of hospitals, schools, and affordable housing developments, are also underway to improve access to health care, education, and housing for all Nigerians. 7. The Eco-Atlantic City, also known as the Nigerian International Commercial City, is a groundbreaking urban development project that is reshaping the skyline of Lagos State, Nigeria. Situated on reclaimed land from the Atlantic Ocean, this planned city represents a remarkable feat of engineering and innovation aimed at addressing the burgeoning population growth and urbanization challenges facing the region. Upon completion, the eco-Atlantic city is poised to become a vibrant metropolis, accommodating an estimated 250,000 residents and facilitating a daily flow of 150,000 commuters. Designed to be a model of sustainable urban living, the city will boast state-of-the-art infrastructure, green spaces, and cutting-edge amenities to enhance the quality of life for its residents. The development of the eco-Atlantic city is being spearheaded through a public-private partnership with private companies and investors providing funding and expertise alongside strategic support from the Lagos state government and the government of Nigeria. This collaborative approach harnesses the strengths of both the public and private sectors, ensuring efficient resource allocation, timely implementation, and sustainable management of the project. As a strategic hub for commerce, trade, and innovation, the eco-Atlantic city is expected to drive economic growth, attract investment, and create employment opportunities in Lagos State and beyond. 6. The Lagos Mass Rail Transit represents a monumental effort by the government of Nigeria to address the perennial issue of traffic congestion in Lagos, the largest city in Africa. As urbanization continues to surge and the population swells, the strain on transportation infrastructure has become increasingly apparent, necessitating the development of efficient and sustainable mass transit solutions. Managed by the Lagos Metropolitan Area Transport Authority, the Lagos Rail Mass Transit is a rapid rail transit system designed to provide fast, reliable, and accessible transportation for residents and commuters across the sprawling metropolis. The network is envisioned as a key component of the city's integrated transport system, offering an alternative mode of travel that alleviates the strain on roads and highways while reducing travel times and improving connectivity. The first phase of the Lagos Mass Rail Transit, known as the Blue Line, commenced operations on September 4, 2023, marking a significant milestone in the city's transportation evolution. This initial section of the network serves key corridors within Lagos, providing commuters with a convenient and efficient means of traversing the city's urban landscape. Subsequently, the government accelerated efforts to expand the rail network with the introduction of the Red Line, the second phase of the Lagos Mass Rail Transit, which officially commenced operations on February 29, 
2024. This expansion further extends the reach of the rail system, enhancing accessibility to additional neighborhoods and business districts while catering to the growing demand for public transportation services. The implementation of the Lagos Mass Rail Transit underscores Nigeria's commitment to sustainable urban development, economic growth, and improved quality of life for its citizens. By investing in modern, efficient, and environmentally friendly transportation infrastructure, the government aims to enhance mobility, reduce congestion, and stimulate socioeconomic development in Lagos and its environs. As the Lagos Mass Rail Transit continues to expand and evolve, it holds the promise of transforming the way people move within the city, fostering greater connectivity, accessibility, and convenience for millions of residents and visitors alike. Five, the Abuja World Trade Center. It stands as a symbol of Nigeria's aspirations for economic growth and global connectivity, situated in the heart of the country's capital, Abuja. Comprising a complex of eight buildings nestled within the central business district, this ambitious project represents a significant investment in the city's urban landscape and commercial infrastructure. At the forefront of the development are two towering skyscrapers that have already been topped out, serving as prominent landmarks in Abuja's skyline. These structures, along with others currently under construction at various stages of development, are set to redefine the city's architectural profile and enhance its status as a modern cosmopolitan hub. Funding for the construction of the Abuja World Trade Center is sourced from a combination of private financial institutions and private investors, reflecting the confidence and interest of both local and international stakeholders in Nigeria's economic potential. This collaborative financing model underscores the project's appeal to investors seeking opportunities in the burgeoning West African market. Upon completion, the Abuja World Trade Center is poised to emerge as the largest mixed-use development in the West African region, boasting a diverse array of commercial, residential, and leisure facilities. From premium office space and luxury residences to retail outlets, hotels, and recreational amenities, the complex is designed to cater to the diverse needs of residents, businesses, and visitors alike. Moreover, the Abuja World Trade Center is expected to serve as a catalyst for economic growth and urban revitalization, stimulating investment, job creation, and economic activity in Abuja and beyond. As a vibrant epicenter of commerce, culture, and innovation, the complex is poised to attract a diverse array of businesses, professionals, and entrepreneurs, driving dynamism and prosperity in the region. In essence, the Abuja World Trade Center represents a bold vision for the future of Abuja and Nigeria, embodying the country's aspirations for progress, prosperity, and global engagement. 4. The Lekki Free Trade Zone stands as a beacon of economic opportunity and growth in Nigeria, representing one of the most prominent and rapidly expanding free zones in the world. Recognized by the World Bank for its remarkable growth trajectory, this special economic zone, also known as an export processing zone, offers businesses a strategic platform to thrive with minimal customs restrictions. Situated approximately 60 kilometers east of Lagos, the Lekki Free Trade Zone occupies a prime location on a sandy peninsula, bordered by the Atlantic Ocean to the south and Lake Lagoon to the north. This strategic positioning provides businesses within the zone unparalleled access to key transportation routes, facilitating seamless trade and commerce with both domestic and international markets. At the heart of the Lekki Free Trade Zone's success are its key partners, which include the Chinese Consortium, Talarum, Rendezvous, and the Dangote Refinery. These partners bring expertise, investment, and innovation to the zone, driving forward its development and contributing to its status as a dynamic hub of economic activity. Within the Lekki Free Trade Zone, Businesses benefit from a conducive regulatory environment characterized by minimal customs restrictions, streamlined administrative processes, and attractive incentives for investment. This supportive framework enables companies to establish and operate their operations with ease, fostering a vibrant ecosystem of trade, manufacturing, and services. Moreover, the Lekki Free Trade Zone serves as a catalyst for regional development, 
generating employment opportunities, spurring infrastructure investment, and stimulating economic diversification in the surrounding areas. By attracting both domestic and foreign investment, the zone plays a pivotal role in Nigeria's broader economic transformation agenda, driving sustainable growth and prosperity. In conclusion, the Lekki Free Trade Zone represents a shining example of Nigeria's commitment to fostering a conducive business environment and accelerating economic development. 3. The Fourth Mainland Bridge It stands as a monumental infrastructure project envisioned by the government of Nigeria to address the burgeoning transportation needs of Lagos, Africa's largest city and economic powerhouse. Spanning an impressive 38 kilometers in length, this bridge is set to serve as a vital link connecting Lagos Island to Ikorodu, across the expansive Lagos Lagoon, via the bustling neighborhoods of Lakey and Itamaga. Once completed, the fourth mainland bridge will rank as the second longest bridge in Africa, a testament to its monumental scale and significance in addressing the city's mobility challenges. The bridge's design incorporates several innovative features, including three tall plazas, a 4.5-kilometer lagoon bridge segment, and nine strategically positioned interchanges, all aimed at optimizing traffic flow and enhancing connectivity across the region. Beyond its practical function as a transportation artery, the fourth mainland bridge is also envisioned as a model of sustainability and environmental stewardship. The project includes plans for an eco-friendly environment, incorporating green spaces, pedestrian walkways, and sustainable design principles to minimize its ecological footprint and enhance the quality of life for residents and commuters alike. Furthermore, the construction of the fourth mainland bridge holds the potential to stimulate economic growth and development across Lagos and its surrounding areas. The improved connectivity and accessibility facilitated by the bridge are expected to unlock new opportunities for trade, commerce, and investment, driving forward the city's dynamic urban landscape and fostering inclusive prosperity for its residents. As a transformative infrastructure project, the Fourth Mainland Bridge embodies Nigeria's commitment to advancing sustainable development and addressing the evolving needs of its rapidly growing urban population. Two, the Lekki Deep Seaport. It stands as a monumental achievement in Nigeria's maritime infrastructure landscape, situated within the bustling Lagos Free Zone in Lagos State. As the only currently operational deep seaport in Nigeria, the Lekki Deep Seaport commenced full commercial operations in April 2023, marking a significant milestone in the country's quest to bolster its maritime trade capabilities. With its strategic location and state-of-the-art facilities, the Lekki Deep Seaport is positioned as one of the largest and most advanced seaports in West Africa, serving as a vital gateway for international trade and commerce. The port's three terminals, comprising the liquid terminal, container terminal, and dry bulk terminal, offer comprehensive handling capabilities, catering to a diverse range of cargo types and vessel requirements. The liquid terminal facilitates the efficient handling and storage of liquid cargo, including petroleum products and chemicals while the container terminal serves as a key hub for the import and export of goods, supporting global supply chains and trade flows. Additionally, the dry bulk terminal facilitates the handling of bulk commodities such as grains, minerals, and construction materials, further diversifying the port's cargo handling capacity. Beyond its role as a crucial trade hub, the Lekki Deep Seaport is poised to catalyze economic growth and development across Nigeria, driving job creation, investment attraction, and industrial expansion within the Lagos Free Zone and its surrounding areas. Its surrounding By providing world-class infrastructure and streamlined logistics services, the port enhances Nigeria's competitiveness on the global stage, attracting foreign investment and facilitating the country's integration into the global economy. Moreover, the Lekki Deep Seaport underscores Nigeria's commitment to sustainable development and maritime excellence, incorporating advanced technology, environmental best practices, and safety standards into its operations. Through continuous innovation and strategic partnerships, the port seeks to optimize efficiency, minimize environmental impact, and ensure the seamless flow of goods and vessels in and out of Nigeria's waters. One, the Centenary City Project, 
It stands as a visionary endeavor in Nigeria's quest for urban development and economic progress, situated in the federal capital territory of Abuja, just southwest of the bustling capital city. Positioned a mere five kilometers from the Abuja International Airport, the centenary city is strategically located to serve as a hub of activity and innovation within the region. At its core, the centenary city represents a meticulously planned urban development scheme, meticulously crafted to embody Nigeria's aspirations for a modern, dynamic, and sustainable future. Conceived as part of the broader Centenary City Free Economic Zone initiative, the project aims to establish a world-class urban center that rivals renowned global metropolises such as Dubai, Monaco, and Singapore. Central to the vision for the Centenary City is its designation as a future smart city, leveraging cutting-edge technology, innovative design principles, and sustainable development practices to enhance quality of life, foster economic growth, and promote social inclusion. From state-of-the-art infrastructure and advanced transportation systems to green spaces and eco-friendly initiatives, every aspect of the city's development is carefully planned to create a vibrant, resilient, and livable urban environment. Moreover, the centenary city serves as a symbol of Nigeria's commitment to harnessing its vast potential and embracing the opportunities of the 21st century. By creating a conducive ecosystem for investment, entrepreneurship, and innovation, the project aims to attract domestic and foreign capital, spur job creation, and catalyze economic diversification across various sectors. As Nigeria's flagship smart city project, the centenary city holds the promise of transforming the country's urban landscape, driving sustainable development, and positioning Abuja as a global leader in innovation and urban excellence. Thank you for watching this video to the end. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. See you next time.